In this video, we're going to show how to create Kaplan-Meier curves using R. First things first, we need a data set. Each Kaplan-Meier has three essential variables. The time component, the event component, whether the event occurred or not, and the groups that we are comparing. We need to install these three packages on R before moving forward. Once these packages are installed, we tell R that we're about to use them with this code. Taking a step back, attaching a file to R, or attaching a data set rather, import data set from Excel, browse, find your file. I like to attach the file that I'm going to use in R so that I know everything below it. R is going to use this data set. Next, create a variable. I called it KM curve and I defined it with a survival function. This is the code, survival function, the time component followed by the event, and this is going to be the comparison group. Again, tell R that the data we're going to use is, in this case, KM curve example. So once we do this, I'm going to run the code now. The way I like to run the code is I like to highlight it and on my keyboard command enter for Mac or control enter on Windows. So now this is stored in R and I'm going to use this variable and plot it. This is the plot we get but we're not done. Just a quick note the ggsurf plot comes from this package so again it's important to install the packages and tell R that we're about to use it before beginning. So over here I want to manipulate the graph a little bit here. So I open up ggsurplot again. I tell that I'm going to use this variable that I created and I'm going to set my x limit from 0 and over here actually I'm going to do 60 for 5 years. And I'm going to break my x interval by every 12 years. I'm not going to label my y axis or my x axis. I want all right, to calculate a p-value, I want to see a risk table. I don't want to see a risk table title. It gets cluttery. And I want to name my two groups, arm A and arm B. I don't want to title them again because it's really cluttered. You could... And instead of fractions, I want percents. I want blue and red. And I want to title my graph and risk table height for good measure. So we'll run this code. And there we go. RMA, RMB, overall survival, percent, the p-value, colors as we mentioned, the intervals of 12 months from 0 to 60, and our risk table. And this could be adjusted to however you want. I'm going to include the code in the description. Lastly, a nice feature is summary, and again, comes from this package. And this is going to tell us, summarize the Kaplan-Meier data from time 0 to 60 at every 12 intervals. And here we go, for group 1, you get the time, the N at risk, the event, how many events occurred, the survival, this is 81.3% standard error, and the confidence intervals, which is really useful. And that's how you plot Kaplan-Meier curves using R.